What is up guys, how are you all doing? This is Semi-I and this is the uh, 24th episode of Ultimate Eleven. And we'll start off with a classic Heskey joke. England players, protect yourself from Heskey. Disguise yourself as a goal. Yeah, <laughs> a bit better than yesterday I reckon. Um, we go off into the first game, he's got pretty similar all-round stats to us. And when you see his team, he's got a bloody storage. Oh my god. I hate storage so much on this game. He seems to be just a beast against me. Also, Anelka. Anelka always scores against me. I'm not sure why. He's got terrible stats. And look at this dreadful goal. <clears throat> That's about three or four deflections in there. And, uh, yeah, that was just truly shocking. Another EA troll in this episode. Oh, and, guys, this is quite a long episode. I think it's like nine minutes. Uh, so, you know, if you don't have that much time, then I'll probably come back and watch it later. Uh, but still give it a thumbs up, of course. <laughs> uh, then we went through with Ben Zema, and he smashes across the keeper. Really powerful. So, uh, not sh uh, he couldn't really do much about that. This is the music. Yeah, that's the music I uh, chose for the good goal. That was a 25-yard free kick, so I decided that was good enough for it. Um, and then we went through again with Jara, and he's a bit of a beast at finishing. I'm not sure why he's so good, but he seems pretty quick. He's got like 81 pace, uh, 81 dribbling and 4-star skills, so he's actually a really good player, guys. Definitely recommend him. He goes through again, and how about that for a finish? He just opens his body so well and uh, does the keeper completely. I want to talk about something in this episode, but you know, I'll set later after all this is finished because we actually uh, do something a bit mental. No, I saw this screen and I was a bit like, what am I meant to do? Um, I had like bronze contract spare, so I put it on the players that I could, and then I went out and tried to get a goalkeeper. I saw Given going cheaply, and he has amazing diving and a uh, I think it's reflexes so uh, yeah I went out and got him well I bid on him and then I played a game we'll see if we got him later on <clears throat> but this guy's got a really good team as well damn I keep on playing really good teams I'm gonna try and hunt for a Christmas noob later and this guy's playing five of the back it's not actually the best team but he does have a strong strike partnership in uh, Hernandez and Gibral Cisse both really big and black <clears throat> um, and an absolutely awful finesse shot from Thiago. I'm not sure how that went so badly wrong. But uh, going short from the goal. And Ben Sem is there just to get the nice little rebound goal here. Um, Vela goes through again and he's an absolute retard. <coughs> I tried to do the fancy flick pass in but ended up just passing it which is pretty disappointing. <clears throat> um, one thing I definitely want to talk about in this episode is are you and guys enjoying the series because I know you guys are giving me like all these likes and I don't know if that's because you're liking the series just liking the one episode I'm not sure so um, if you could I would be like really grateful if you could just like post what you're thinking about the series so far um, just like if there's anything I should do to make it slightly better because you know I'm always trying to get better I'm always trying to, you know, improve my commentaries, like, do stuff to make me unique from other commentators and stuff like that. And, um, I was just, I kind of, I kind of do it for you guys as well. So, like, if you guys aren't enjoying it, then I won't be enjoying making it. But, um, I am quite enjoying doing the series. It is, like, really fun playing with the team and all. But I'm not sure where I can go with it. Because, as I said before, it kind of takes quite a bit of money. There's quite a big gap in the market from around 2k to like like 15k, so uh, it's pretty hard. So I'm not sure what team to do. Maybe I should switch it up a bit. Maybe you guys can suggest like two teams and I'll make a hybrid of them like Brazil and Argentina or something like that. So it gives me kind of more options. 
but we had enough money just about to buy a gold pack and seeing as you know we don't have any contracts I thought I'd just do it um, and you know spice up the series a bit <laughs> not really I guess but I just thought I might as well I've got them coins for once maybe a bit of a stupid decision as it paid out there seeing as we got absolutely dreadful pack our shiny was a Florentina away kit God's sake. Um, I do try and salvage literally everything. And why would they give me like two contracts for players and then two manager contracts? It just seems like they like trolling on people for no reason. Um, the leg healing can sell. Corinthians awake kit I didn't bother with. I literally got about everything. I decided to make that kit my um, actual away kit. I'm not sure why. I just thought a change would be quite good. And then I think I sent all of these players to the trade pile just in case they could sell for like a few hundred coins more. Because then if we can get, literally if we can salvage everything, then uh, that'll be quite good. And it'll leave us more money to buy stuff like a new goalkeeper. And this time I could have got Doni, um, but I decided to go for a, a Begovic from Stoke. And that's because Begovic is he's so big. I'm not even joking, I think he's like 6 foot like 5 or something like that. And um, I've played one game with him and he was so good for me that game. Honestly, he probably saved me about 4 or 5 goals even though the guy wasn't the best. But um, he turns out a really good goalkeeper. I'm pretty pleased that I got him instead of Doni again because Doni was a good keeper. He didn't actually make too many mistakes, just the occasional one. But you know, I just thought I should change it up a bit. And then we go into our next game, all the sides like kind of refreshed, put the people with low fitness on the bench and whatnot. And I was bricking it when this guy came up. He's got a really, really good team. Um, Higuain, Di Maria, Javier Pastore, a Levesi. Oh, Levesi is good. His defence, I was kind of like, I was worried, but then his defence didn't seem that good. Um, so, you know, I wasn't that worried. But I had an absolute crack of a shot with Aga. So nearly came off. And this guy's kind of... He's so stupid passing it short. Um, and Ben Senna nearly didn't get the open goal finish because it was with his weak foot. But I'll leave you guys here with another song. Good goal kind of thing. If you guys were like wondering why was that goal so special, um, I would probably say it did actually nuts him in the process of scoring and you know nutsing a player is pretty enjoyable. I might be making a nuts kind of episode where, because I've got a few where you just nuts the player and then score, so I think that would be pretty unique and pretty cool to show up, hopefully you guys would enjoy that. But Benzema gets um, a goal back and I think he... He didn't really do anything wrong there. I think the ref's just being a bit of a dick, just giving a pen when he's like 4 0 down. Um, and when like people I know are really terrible at FIFA, and I kind of feel a bit sorry for them, I just chip it um, because I don't know. I kind of feel sorry and I don't really want to score, but I'll just take the piss a bit and just go for a bit of a chip. But Benzema finds Arteta, does a really nice scoop thing past two players goes and really simple dribbling this guy was absolutely awful at defending I know like most people aren't the best but this guy was really really bad believe me um, this has been the end of the episode guys I hope you guys enjoyed it remember to hit that like button every like helps loads and I'm, I'm meaning that really genuinely please post a comment on what you're thinking about the series and uh, that's all from me hope you guys enjoyed that 6-0 win um hope you guys have a nice day and see you later bye guys